Hi, this is Guy Delosier, Senior Applications Engineer for Go Engineer. Today we're going to talk about pattern driven component patterns in an assembly. I've got this part file here that's got several different configurations just to show different types of patterns here. And it doesn't make any difference uh, what type of pattern uh, you've got to start with. Uh, you can use any of these to do your uh, pattern driven component pattern of uh, in an assembly. So let's go over to the assembly here. <clears throat> so here's our part in the assembly. This is, happens to be the linear pattern. I've got one component in here which is a uh, socket head cap screw uh, and I want to put it in all of these different instances of this uh, uh, linear pattern. So we'll go up here to linear component pattern and hit the drop down and pick pattern driven component pattern. So I want to pick the uh, component to pattern, which is that, then right click and then choose any one of the pattern holes, makes no difference, and right click, boom, we're done. That easy. So let's undo this and do this again on another one or two here real quick. Uh, let's try a fill pattern. Now fill pattern is something that's usually used for like a, a an air grate or a drain grate or something like that where you have a large number of holes on the surface. But it could be used to, you know, to put holes for, for something to fasten together. So um, we can use that just as well as any of the other types of patterns. So if we pick pattern driven component pattern, pick the component, right click, and pick any one of the holes, right click, there we are. Now that folks, that's power. It uh, works so nice. It's just, uh, it's just amazing. Uh, let's do one more here real quick, and uh, we'll change this to a um, curve-driven pattern. Okay. Again, one that's not. Uh, it's it's used every so often, but uh, uh, it's always some weird shape generally. And uh, we'll pick the uh, the pattern-driven component pattern. Pick the component, right click, and again, any one of the holes makes no difference, and it populates, you know, as fast as your screen refreshes usually. So, again, this is Guy Delosier, Go Engineer, wishing you a great day and good patterning.